everybody welcome back to my channel I'm going to do a review on the Louis Vuitton Alma BB and also um, a little backstory on the Alma I did own the Alma and um, probably when I well it was my first bag the Alma PM was my first bag um, in monogram and that was probably back in 2002 was the first um, when I first started buying Louis Vuitton. And I carried that bag probably for two or three years, nonstop, it was the only Louis Vuitton bag I had. I loved it. Um, I thought I was the shiznit. And then um, I, after that, I gave it and let my daughter use it because I think I had gotten another um, purse for Christmas um, a few years later. And so she used it and pretty much when it was done, it looked like it had been drugged behind the car. Um, not really that bad, but it was, it was pretty bad. Anyway, um, I ended up selling that. I was still able to sell it, um, to a lady here where I live and, um, she got to use the bag and love the bag too. So it had a lot of loving on it. Anyway, um. I really liked it and um, I had gotten, I have had the Alma BB and Epi and I liked the bag, but I didn't really care for the Epi leather um, that well. I love the monogram. That's, this is my favorite print. Absolutely. And I like the Vachetta. Um, I've never owned a bag long enough other than that Alma um, to where it really got dark. Um, but usually by the time they get that dark, then I'm done with them and I pass them on. But anyway, I wanted to show y'all um, this bag. And also I wanted to um, tell y'all something that I kind of figured out. You know, these locks, I had a um, Speedy and the lock, I never used it. I kept it in the little dust bag that it came with and it still um, tarnished and looked terrible. Well, I was going to sell that um, purse to fashion file and um, I didn't want to sell it to him with the lock all tarnished looking. And so my husband was helping me um, and he got my silver cleaning cloth, which is this one right here, and um, polished it up and it looked brand new. I mean, you couldn't, there, it took the tarnish right off. So these silver cleaning cloths do clean your locks. And anyway, I got this from um, Fashion Fall and it was in new condition. It was excellent. And, but the lock was tarnished on it and I just got the silver cleaning cloth. I probably need to do it again, but um, clean that up. And so it pretty much matches the hardware on the bag now. But um, I've had this bag uh, maybe two or three weeks now and I've carried it a couple of times already. I really like it. Um, it hits me at a good spot. I'm 5'2", and I like it. It comes down just barely past my hip. So a little bit longer, but I like the little bit longer um, strap length. Anyway, it has feet on the bottom. I'm sure y'all have seen the Alma BB. It's been around forever. Anyway, I'll show you what I have in here. I have a calendar book and you can get a lot in this bag. I would say I have um, the Nano Speedy and I can get as much in this bag as the Nano Speedy and vice versa. I mean, for little bags, they really pack a punch. Anyway, back to what's in my bag. I have my little pochette here. And it has the same stuff it always does when I'm showing you these videos. My key, six ring key holder, my key clay, and some gum and Kleenex, and a Louis Vuitton card case in the men's. I really, I think it's graphite. Anyway, I really like the dark color. I wish they made women's in the black and gray. And then just in case, we don't get a lot of rain here, but just in case it was, there's a, um, this is a little nylon bag 
and I could put this in there if we had got hit with rain or whatever and at least protect my bag. And then I have my little um, Apple Air Tag. And then I carry this in most of my bags. It's a little personal Bible. And I had gotten this, I had applied for a job and um, there was a gentleman sitting next to me. He, he was at a medical office and it, he was getting treated and he handed me this and I just thought it was sweet. And so I keep it in all my purses. Why not have a Bible We're with you at all times, right? <laughs> anyway, anyway, that's about all I had to say. Yes, I am in the same clothes I did the video I had this one on, but I wanted to try to get at least a couple of videos done today. And I just wanted to say thank you to everyone who subscribed to my channel. And I hope you all have a great day. Thank you. Bye.